This is Bob Payne, Chief Investment Strategist here at Payne Capital Management with this week's market update. This week on the Street of Dreams, global stock market surged higher for its biggest weekly gain in more than a year. Investors and markets celebrated the fact that the Federal Reserve finally made their first move and raised the Fed funds rate by 25 basis points. That's a quarter of 1%. Economists now expect six more quarter point hikes this year. And that means we can expect a hike at every meeting between now and the end of the year, bringing the Fed's fund rate by year's end to one and three quarters percent. In addition, the Fed expects to begin reducing their $9 trillion balance sheet at the next meeting by selling 75 to $100 billion worth of bonds monthly. That's the fastest pace ever. I guess many of you, like my clients, are sitting there and wondering, how did the market go up and why are investors celebrating with the Federal Reserve taking away the punch bowl while inflation is at 8% and rising? Well, to me, it makes perfect sense. Once you realize markets are forward looking. The repricing of stocks started back in January in anticipation of the Fed raising interest rates, which they did this week. Inflation, on the other hand, has surged for many reasons. And many of those reasons had to do with a once in a lifetime, once in a generation pandemic. Now, as COVID wanes, Forward-looking markets care more about inflation's path over the coming year, not the past year. As COVID cases fall, lingering restrictions end, and supply chain disruptions fade, price pressures will subside sooner rather than later. Consumers are quickly returning to their pre-pandemic behavior that favors services-based economic activity, leading to a leveling off in the price of goods, perhaps even a decline, and along with it, inflation. Maybe this is why the 10-year Treasury yield, highly sensitive to inflation and inflation expectations, isn't signaling much longer-term concern. It closed Friday with a 2.1% yield that's actually lower than its pre-pandemic level. Overall, a great week for stocks. And ultimately, they're heading back to new all-time highs. I just don't know when. I just hope it's not next week because our portfolio goes ex-dividend and we'll have cash to invest. And as you all know, I love to buy low. My son Ryan and I have 68 years of combined industry experience building low cost, tax efficient, goal based portfolios. For your free evaluation, all you have to do is text or call 844 752 6692. That's 844 752 6692. Or just simply call 844 PLAN NYC. That's 844 PLAN NYC. Hey, this is Bob Payne. I'm the Chief Investment Strategist here at Payne Capital Management.